The Lord is so good. The Lord is so good. The Lord is awesome in all of his ways. Can I tell you, the songwriter knew what he was talking about when he said, I searched all over. Couldn't find nobody. I looked high and low. I still couldn't find nobody. Nobody greater. Nobody greater than you. Can I tell you, as much as my mother loves me, can I tell you she cannot do me like Jesus can? I'm trying to find a witness. I don't care how much your spouse say they love you, they can't do you like Jesus. Your sister and your brother, they may love you, but can't nobody do you like Jesus. I just need to lean on somebody and tell them, can't nobody do you like Jesus. This time, look across the room at somebody and say, hey, old man, I got good news for you, too. The glory is coming back. This time, touch yourself, touch your sanctity, in the old side. This time, touch your sanctified self. I uh, don't make it a habit to touch yourself and say the glory. It's the most significant use of the ideas of glory and majesty is their application to God. In this regard, it is sometimes stated that God's glory is the external manifestation of so his glory. we have digressed from where we used to be. Can I tell you, I'm all right right now, but we're going we to get there in a few minutes. Can I tell you, there was a time if you were blind, you could come to church and God would open up blinded eyes. I'm not talking to nobody on this side over here because y'all acting like y'all don't know what's going on. There was a time when people would come to church and actually die in the service. But they were praying before the service was over. God raised them up. There was a time when our church was so powerful. Of people that had been diagnosed with cancer and tumors, they would come to church and cancer would dry up. Our tumors would fall off. I can't hear nobody. But now, we come to church and it ain't nothing but a fashion show. Somebody else's bedroom, we still go home and play with ourselves. 